Hey everyone, hey dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ. I thought we'd take a little trip to Turkey today. We're going to look at singer-songwriters from Turkey. Doing this channel has made me realize that, of course, the world is indeed biblical, and we're not all that different. Around the whole world, it's the same thing. Like, some people are on team, <laughs> the losing team, I will say. And there's some people, of course, that have faith in Jesus Christ. I pray and I hope that more Christians will actually see, like, how far gone the world is and why God tells us that Satan's the small g God of this place and to not love the world. Right? I, I hope people will see that. And... I do not hate these people. On this channel, I, I'm promoting that. I, I don't want us to hate these people. We don't have to like what they do. They're selling out, They but they're selling out themselves ultimately. So it's really up to them. Tarkin is a singer-songwriter from Turkey. He's clearly doing the Eye of Horus here, one-eye symbolism. He's doing it again here. He's hanging out with the Freemason checkerboard. Yes, they have the Freemason checkerboard in Turkey. Emery is doing the vow of silence here. Is he keeping the secret of the biblical whole world about fame, fortune, and success, and most likely about Freemasonry? Hadis is a singer-songwriter from Turkey, doing the vow of silence, doing the vow of silence, doing the vow of silence. Mehmet is doing the hidden hand of a Freemason. Karasem Another singer-songwriter from Turkey is hiding his hand in his coat, the way a Freemason would do. And they even do my favorite gesture, the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. The whole world is deceived by Satan. The Bible tells us this. Actually knowing it for yourself is really something. And it's helped me in my walk with Jesus because I know the world is nothing great to hang on to. A lot of people love their life. They want their best life now. They want fame, fortune, and success. Not even that in some cases. I will take Jesus Christ in truth. I love our Lord Jesus Christ. I love that he is God. It makes me feel very comfy. I love that the Lord is God. I love that Lord Jesus. You know, he's done so much for us. Uh, I'm truly blessed in my life. That That doesn't mean I have a perfect life. Far from it. But knowing that I have salvation... That's a wonderful feeling. And sometimes I, I doubt that a little bit. You, I think you guys know what I mean, right? Like, I'm sure I have salvation, but I don't want to be like, I have salvation and blah, blah, blah. No, because it's a very humble thing. It's like, like we're all so fallen from where God is. Like, we, we fail very much. And we're in this sinful world where the flesh is weak. Brothers and sisters, let's look at the world and pray for these people and try and shine light on the darkness so people see that's the world I love so much. That's the entertainment I just can't get enough of. Wow, I should check. Like, it should put a check in people's spirit. And hopefully it'll make more people watching this run to Jesus and not be so involved in the world and like fame, fortune, celebrity, chasing whatever the world seems to want, right? Brothers and sisters and everyone else, God bless you.